Hello guys, welcome back to another video on the channel and today we're going to do my Premier League official predictions with my four mates, Evie, yeah. Lucas yeah. and Jack. It's going to be a big one, interesting one, we've got 20 to first and then a few topics here and there and everywhere um, after this, so it's a long video. So we'll start off with 20th, who have you got 20th? I put Nottingham Forest just because they've come from the championship, just don't think they'll have a chance. Me? I'll put Fulham because amazing in the championship. We've seen it before, they're, they're yeah. terrible in the Premier League. Yeah. Jack? Bournemouth because they don't really have any squad depth and they don't really have a good squad anyway. We, we also have Teddy's predictions, but sadly he wasn't here to be in the video. Yeah. He put Bournemouth. And I put Southampton just because last season they were pretty dreadful. Five points off safety. That's all right. Imagine that, not That's a bad fair. prediction. I think Southampton, it, it's their time has come. Their time is going to be in the league and they'll, they'll get relegated. Moving on to 19th. I've put Nottingham Forest. The comments, everyone's thinking they're going to be like um, amazing because they're a new team that we haven't seen for a, for a while in the Premier League. But they're, nah, they're, not, they're not here. I put Bournemouth, same reason as not Nottingham Forest because they're new to the Premier League. Not new, but like they've come from a championship, they just won't have a chance either. In 19th place, I put Leeds because I really hate them. Jack, how are Leeds coming 19th? Because I hate them. Okay, fair enough. Right. Well, I've got Fulham just because they're newly promoted. They, you know, they're all right in the Premier League, but squad depth is pretty shambles. They made a few signings, but yeah, I think. It'll be tough to stay up this season. What about Teddy's prediction? He has put. He has put. He has put. Uh, Southampton. Good man! What can I say? Yeah. Southampton are terrible. I'm just going to squeeze yeah. this bit there. Go on, James. Alright, in 18th, who have you got? I've got Bournemouth. I've put all three teams that have been promoted back down. But, like, yeah. There, there's so much competition in the Premier League now, they're not, yeah. not going to make it. Yeah. Should I do my go? Yeah. I think in 18th it's going to be Nottingham Forest because I think they're going to fight because they have some big, good players like Brendan Johnson, but they don't have a very good midfield. And they've signed a few people like Fisher Lingard, but that you, you, you know. Yeah, yeah fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, at 18th I've put Brentford because last season it was quite shocking at the start of that season they were so surprising they literally came up from the championship and they surprised every team like that game against Arsenal game against Liverpool where they drew it was crazy but now I reckon the teams are used to them they'll probably be able to second season yeah. have any of us agreed on one yet? That's yeah I agree with 18th, 18th with Brentford, Brentford. I'd be saying it's different second season oh. syndrome it hurts it kills teams. It okay. kills teams. Um, and yeah, I think the people suss them out. Good prediction. Oh. Yeah. This is your job, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah sorry. <laughs> it's hard. Nottingham Forest. Yeah, oh, I agree. I've agreed on Teddy with a lot of mine. I forgot. I have to agree on Teddy with two of mine. I don't know. Oh, no. 17th? Oh, yeah, 17th. Who you got 17th? I've got Leeds 17th. I reckon because they're in the. Relegation battle again, but I think they're just going to overcome. Uh, at 17th, I've put Southampton. just don't see them in the Premier League. Not, no, I just don't see them doing well. They, uh, they always have a good game against City, but I just don't see it happening. At 17th, I put Southampton as well because they don't have a good striker. And how can, how can your top goal scorer be a centre midfielder? Teddy has put Fulham for the 17th position. In 17th, I've got Everton. I think they yeah, have a shocking season again. Yeah, Frank Lampard, a very um, he's not a good manager at all, inexperienced. Uh, Chelsea, they had one good season at Chelsea, but you know anyone can have a good season at Chelsea. Um, yeah, Everton for me will just survive again. I did it last season. Yeah, so 17th for me. Everton. Moving on to 16th. 16th, I've got Everton. Again, what James said, I just don't think they'll be doing good in the Premier League again. They'll be relegated in a few years, I reckon. 
at 16 if I put Fulham, same with, but they won't do well, but they'll get a couple scrapes off like small teams like Bournemouth, Nottingham Forest and all those, so they'll, they'll stay up. Um, at 16 if I put Brentford because they're not very good, but I think they're better than the other teams down there. I think they beat teams like Forest and Bournemouth. And I learned Tony's alright. What's Tony then? He's put Brentford. I have put, I put Brentford. I've put Forest. Really? I think Jesse Lingard will have a masterclass and keep Forest up. And they're not a bad side. You know, you've got to look at Forest and think, wow, what a team. Because they're a good team. A strong side, strong unit. Yeah, we'll see where they go. But for me, they'll provide the 16th comfortably as well. Moving on to 15th. Um, I've got Brentford in 15th. I don't think they'll be doing terrible. I'm, they're definitely not going to get relegated. But again, like they're not going to do as well as they did last season. I'd put Leeds just because I don't really like them. That's what they did to Elliot. Oh, yeah, Elliot. Really good one. Oh, yeah. What number is it? 15. Yeah. I put Everton because yeah. they're awful. <laughs> and they don't have a they, they don't have a very good defending. So uh, these? Got to say. Uh he's put Leeds as well. I put Villa. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'll explain this because Jackie would have found me a bit angry about this sort of stuff. Um, for me, Villa, because. Why? Go on. Last season they finished, what, 14th? Something like that? Yeah. Yeah. This season, yeah, yeah, well done. You signed a few players here and there and everywhere. But, still, I think the competition in front of me right now is absolutely insane. And yeah, let's say if Villa come 10th, then I'll put my hands up. I like this, I'll put my hands up so I've got it wrong. But, it, it's one of those predictions you like, really, can that happen? And I think it can happen. I think Villa can finish 15th. Jack's seen it on Happy Bunny over there. But, you know, I'm not a big fan of Villa as a cop fan. Um, so, yeah, for me, Villa, a thinking season. Season Gerard, yeah, he's an alright manager. You know, did well in the Scottish Premier League. What's, what's that? What's that? That's like, yeah. You well, wait, yeah, you me. wait for my number 14. Just, just you wait. Alright, so who you got 14 then? No, we didn't. Yeah. Are we doing City? Yeah. Oh, yeah. 14, I've got <laughs> Southampton. They're not like, people are saying they're going to get rid of it, but I reckon they'll scrape it. I reckon it'll be close from about 14th all the way down to 18th. Yeah. I've put Everton, just again, because I don't like them. Is that it? So. Yeah. And because they're just terrible. Like, look at them, Frank Lampard. He ain't, he's just not the only one for Terrible at Chelsea, terrible at Everton is just how it works. So, 14th, I've got Coventry City. <laughs> oh, wait, that was my championship predictions. <laughs> well then, Jack. Instead, I've got Fulham. Cause it's so salty. Because they have Mitrovic. They have, they have Mitrovic, and he's quite good because he scored a lot of goals last year. In the championship. In the championship. But still, that's the championship. Yeah, but. as well because they they're a good team but they don't have 
the streamer anymore, and he was their best player. Yeah. And I've, I've gone for Bullworth. Bullworth. <laughs> because, no, nah, no, nah, hear me out, hear me out. Because, no, oh. nah, they got some decent players, and last season they actually did really well. And I think, you know, yeah, they had five years in the Prem and then two years in the Championship. I think they've grown, they've got a decent manager. I just think they'll do well. I don't know, it's going to hit them. It's going to all hit them and they'll get results. Yeah, but they don't have a good team. They have an all right team. Who's the, who's, who's the best player? Yeah, sure. Solanke. Solanke's good. Solanke's probably the what? One of the worst players in the league, though, isn't he? Yeah. Yeah, but they've got that keeper, Joe, that's just quite good. Who's the keeper? <laughs> Who else I've got in Newcastle? Everyone's saying, oh, they've got loads of money, they're going to come, they're going to get Europe football. It's not happening. Who else I've got in Newcastle? Um, everyone's saying because they've got all these like, <laughs> fancy Nancy owners. It's not happening. Yeah, fair enough, fair enough. Who you got, Tiffin? I think I'll put Newcastle as well. You do? Yeah, because they're just that average team, aren't they? They've got all yeah. the money, I don't know what they're doing with it. Kieran Trippi are not big enough, I don't think. That's not going to change anything. Yeah, true. Whatever what you got, Jack? Oh, no. Um, I've got Wolves. <laughs> oh, no! It's getting heated! <laughs> it's getting heated! <laughs> <laughs> How's the Wolves though, no, Jack? You're not mad. Throat was down. Alright, Jack, explain everything I've, I've got Wolves because everything annoyed me earlier. <laughs> they, 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 they've got a good team, but they don't have a very they need an out and out striker because yeah, Raheem yeah. Lennon hasn't really been saying ever since he's got like this oh, headache. Mm. His headache? Headache. Are you mad? Head That's the nicest yeah. way to put it. Oh, so Alright, who, what's Teddy got, Swelch? He's got <laughs> Villa. He's got Villa, Swelch. I've got Newcastle, yeah. Swelch. The yeah. same as Eddie and Tippin. I think Newcastle. Um, yeah. They're alright. Take that. Money, they've got all money, no brains, really. They're literally like, they can have money, but what are they going to find? Like, let's be honest. Like, no one's going to want to go to there. Yeah, these money brothers. Alright, move on. City, City, City won the Prem, is it like two years after getting there, all their money? Well, to be fair, they could, they could surprise us. Yeah, but they don't have a manager like Pep Guardiola, do they? Yeah, but I think, I think, I think they'll get another That's manager soon. Have. They probably will, but. Yeah. Alright, should we move on to 11th? Who you got? 11th, I've got Crystal Palace. I reckon they'll be alright. Like, not the best, yeah, but I, I reckon they will be better. That's a shame. I'm not surprised. What you got I've got Palace as well. <laughs> and, uh, Vieira, isn't it? Just because he was a, an amazing football player back in the day, I don't think he's going to be a brilliant manager. Yeah, he's just did that with Frank it. Lampard as well. Yeah. Frank Lampard's an abysmal manager. But right, it's, yeah. it's, it's different for. Obviously, you know, being dark. Yeah, um, Jack, you got. Well, I've got Crystal Palace because I think they're, they're around there, but I don't think they're good enough to push for Europe, and I don't think they're going to get relegated anytime soon. They've got some good players, and I think we might all have Crystal Palace there. Alright, well, we'll say you've got 11. <laughs> He's got the Wolves. Um, look who's above Wolves. Who did you put above Wolves? Oh my god. Is that Everton? Alright, no, no, it's. I've got 11th right at uh, I've got Brighton 11th. You are I've got Brighton. Jim, who's Brighton's best player? They actually had a really good season. Brighton's best player. Who's Brighton's best player? They've got Cucurella. Fair enough. They might go to City though. What did he go to City? And they've got Sanchez as well on goal. He's like half decent. He's alright. They've got Trossard as well. They've got a few good players. Like you can't underestimate this Brighton side. They they will go out and they will thrash Man United four 0 It's as simple as that. If you want to do a fair Brighton, then fair enough. But I don't. It's simple as that. Who you got 10th? 10th. Got Aston Villa. Fair I mean, I wanted to put them lower, but yeah. They're, um, they'll just, they're your average Premier League team as well. I got Villa as well. What? <laughs> what? 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 How? I don't know. Uh, I, I just think Villa is going to be a mid team. Yeah, mid team. Team for a bit and. So, in in my tenth place, once again, I agree with Ebby and Lucas Tippins, and I have Aston Villa. Ebby put Villa and like. I know how you put Villa. Yeah, me and me, us two have just agreed on a lot of things. Alright, what's, yeah. what's Teddy done? Let's have a. Oh! I can't believe it. Oh.
Everton, Everton <laughs> above Wolves. What Yo. is this, man? He's having a laugh. Also for Leicester City, because last season they were awful. This season, James Vine's old. Harvey Barnes is old. Um, not old. Harvey Barnes is like young. But they're just not that good of a signing one. They lost Perez. They only have cash for Schmeichel, but still, they're just not... There's an average mid-table. Barley's getting old now yeah. as well. Yeah, should we move on to ninth, though? I can't believe you're on ninth. Uh, ninth, I've got Leicester. As James was saying, they're not going to be pushing for European football anymore, but yeah. they're still all right. They've got a good manager. Brendan Rodgers is actually a good manager. Oh, yeah. I've put Leicester as well. <laughs> you agree, so much. You did. Woo. Leicester, they used to be cracking. They used to be a scary team to play against, but earlier in the yeah. season... Yeah. No, they used to be brilliant. They, yeah. they bought a Champions League twice. Yeah. 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 And... Where's Jamie Vardy gone? Yeah. Yeah. Who's Jamie Vardy? Is the question. Alright, Jack, who you got I've got Leicester. <laughs> um, you know, they're, they're quite good, and I think Madison will have a good season, but and I still think Vardy will score a few goals. Who's Teddy? Crystal Palace. Fair enough, fair enough. I've got Leeds United. Are like, you maybe wondering, James, why have you got Leeds United? Why? That's a good question. Um. It's <laughs> have a reason. <laughs> Dan James, decent. Dan James. <laughs> Patrick Bamford to be scared. That's an alright start. That's an alright player. Arden Marsh, the American superstar, was doing alright. Don't underestimate this Leeds United side. Who got eighth? Eighth, I've got ooh, Man United. Fair Man United. Well, there. I mean, Ronaldo's getting old. I mean, you never know. Ten Hag could do a good job. What oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> I've got not. I've got eighth. I've got um, Wolves because they're big. They're still a decent team. There, they're. Um, I I don't know why it's Liverpool. I always scared to play them, and Liverpool struggled against them a lot. Like nil nil one, nil nil all game like, uh, last season, and they just. What's it called? <laughs> Waffling so so much. Uh, oh, I just jacked. Yeah, they snatched it in the last. Yeah, thing. I actually just jacked. I jacked eight. Jack, who's got eight? I put Newcastle. Oh my because, god. What the heck? Because they have lots of money, and when when and when you have lots of money, you can sign big good players <laughs> with all the money. Nice one, Jack. Right, I've also got. He has got um, Leicester. Fair enough. Fair enough. Not bad. I've got eight. West Ham United. Mark Noble's gone. That's all I need to say. What? So now, because of Mark Noble, they're not going to get European football. Nah, nah. All right. Hear, hear me out. Hear me out. Last season, they finished like seventh. Did they? Yeah, they did. And I think, I don't know. I think they'll lose a position this season. They're not a bad team. Like, they're not a bad team, but for me they finish eight. I think they'll just miss out on Conference League to a team. Someone here supports them. Oh, Alright, who you got in seventh? Seventh I've got Wolves Conference League. I might be a bit biased, but I think no one's gonna expect it and we will snatch European football. Fair enough, fair enough. Tippet. Uh Man United. Just because they're not built for the Champions League. Just you get they get knocked out. Really soon in the Champions League, they'll be Europa League team. Fair enough, Jack. I've got Man United for the same reason as Lucas, because they're not they're not as good as the other teams. Oh, fair enough, Jack. Right, what shall he got? Uh, he has got. Let me do all this. Uh, <laughs> Man United as well. Oh, I've got Wolves. I think they'll get an out and out striker in the next month and I think they'll dominate champion, um, dominate top seven. I think they'll finish dominate seven. top seven. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Dominate top seven. No, I think I think they'll they'll snatch it. It'll be between them and United, West West Ham United. I'm gonna go down to the last game. West Ham United will flop. Wolves will uh, will dominate their game and I think Wolves will get top seven. Can we go to six? Six I've got six I've got West Ham. They used to be fighting for relegation, but I don't know how they've managed to become such a good club. And I see them as like European football. 
Sorry. I've got West Ham as well. <laughs> <laughs> Just because I think it's going to be quite a repeat of last season because mm, yeah. last season surprised like Brentford did, but Brentford aren't really the same. West Ham did it cracking in the Europa League, I think. Yeah, they got to the semis. Yeah. Uh, Good in the Premier League as well, beating. Uh, did they beat Man City? Yeah, or Liverpool? City. Yeah, that brought Liverpool's hopes up, but it's sadly, you know, Villa bottled it. Yeah, Villa yeah. bottled it. Right, Jack, who have you got? I got West Ham at six oh. because they have the best team spirit in the league, oh. and you know, yeah. ever since they almost got relegated that one year, they just they the the, the team has really pulled themselves together. Yeah. And they've just been like flying and doing amazing ever since, you know. Yeah, that's true. They hold their heads high. They don't have the best team, but you know they make they make good use of what they have. You know, doing amazingly, getting the Europa League. You know, they're amazing. <laughs> they're an amazing football club. Have we done Teddy's? No, we don't Teddy's. They're, yeah, they're an amazing football club. Yeah, Jack, we get the idea. Right, yeah. <laughs> Teddy's in West Ham as well. Oh my days! Why do we want to put Man United in six? It's one hog, two hog, three hog, four hog, five hog, ten hog would be. Hog. Hog. I think you'd be oh, brilliant. Right. I think. Jack, <laughs> <laughs> there's no need for that. I think Dab De Gea would be on point. I think Varane would be decent. I think Martial would get back to form. Sancho would be back to form. Rashford might be back. Six for me, man. Have you got fifth? Fifth? Chelsea. Oh, that's a, that's a tough take. I reckon they're going to bottle Champions League football. And I just, after this season, I don't think they've got the team spirit anymore. Um, West Ham, I put for fifth. No, not West Ham, Spurs, I put for fifth. I just don't like Spurs, to be honest. Um, I like, no, I don't. Um, just, I reckon they'll just come fifth. No, I don't like Spurs. Ruin no. Alright, Jack, you got? I've got Arsenal. Yeah, I've got Arsenal because they're a good team. They make some good signings, but they just they're just not as good as the other team. <laughs> Why are you say that? <laughs> right, so then, what's Teddy got? What's Teddy got? Uh, he's got um, Tottenham as well. I've got Chelsea. Me and Ebby agree. Oh, again, I think. Um, Ryan Stone, I think, you know, they have a good season. You're saying he's washed, mate. What are you on about? He is washed. No, wash your cup, mate. Like, he, <laughs> is not wa- he is not washed. He's not washed. He's not washed. Okay. It's just because he of waits the, till he gets two goals no, in the season. No, it's just because of the pep root left. Like, he's just he's not playing. You think he's washed? No, he's not. Wash your cups and plates and tables. Like, oh, yeah. That's a good point, mate. Good point. Yeah. Can you look at Abby? What? What? <laughs> fourth. Fourth I've gone with Spurs. I reckon they're going to take the Champions League football away from Chelsea. I've got Arsenal. I just think they're going to use those signings. Gabriel Jesus, Zinchenko. I even reckon that Vieira guy is going to pop up a bit. Oh, fair enough, Dad. Who you got for? Tottenham. Up, Jack, because area. they've got a good team with Kane and Sane, and um, basically, um, they've got a good team, but they're always bottle jobs. And although they did get top four last season and will do this season, I just don't think they can, you know, push to the next level. Right. Number four, yeah, Teddy's got Chelsea. Fair enough. Fair enough. In fourth, I've got Arsenal. Same reasons, different. I think Jesus on fire. Same goal he's got pre season. Brilliant. She's shit. Yeah, Sinchenko, world class. Not really. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm sorry. But I think it'd be decent for Arsenal. Yeah. Um. And yeah, they've got decent signings. Comfortably four. I think Chelsea are gonna have four points gap between Chelsea and Arsenal. All right, third. Top three scenarios. Third of one is Arsenal. I reckon they're past their bottled up stage. They're past their mid table stage, and I reckon they'll do really well. Fair enough. Third, I've got Liverpool. Uh, I am a Liverpool fan, but I reckon. I reckon Man City is going to be clear first, but Chelsea Liverpool are going to be like battling. It's going to be like one or 
one to five points different between Chelsea and Liverpool. So it'll be close. Um, I've got Tito sorry, Scott Tourette. <laughs> I haven't got Tourette's. I've got Chelsea in fourth third place because you know, they're a great team and they have made some good signings. Although they only won one low one centre back. Kuhn Bale is a great player and so is Raheem Sterling and Raheem Sterling has proved it in the Premier League before. So Alright, I'll, I'll do the third, I've got Tottenham. Kane, Son, Link Up will be magical. Got an FPL as well. This that link up play is gonna be absolutely fantastic. And um, <laughs> what the hell? You got Reese is decent, Romero is decent. And this Kane Son link up play is gonna be absolutely brilliant. And I think it's just got so many good players to make up them. We've got Romero, Hugo Lloris as well. And yes, what we want Teddy as well. Teddy has got Arsenal. So. Arsenal. Fair enough. Alright, in second, who have you got? Second, I have Liverpool. I reckon it, it won't go as close as last season with Man City, but I reckon they will be close for like the mid middle part of the season. Charles Chelsea in the second position. <laughs> Because they won't be they won't be anywhere near to Man City in the, at the end of the Prem. But they're signing people saying that Raheem Sterling's gonna be a flop at Chelsea, but I honestly think he he's gonna make a big difference to Chelsea. I think that Liverpool are gonna come second. Why? Why Any they reasons? Got a very good team and Ooh, yeah, that's a good they reason. came second last year. Um, I don't think they're as good as Man City, but they're probably better than all the other teams in the league. Not fair. I've got them to this one as well. Mo Salah, Diaz, Darwin, Masterclass. <laughs> I think they'll flop against City there. I think they'll win every other game apart from City. So they'll flop Teddy's in one put. game. <laughs> they'll crack me. Crack. Teddy's <laughs> put Liverpool in the second position. Alright. Right, moving on to our champions got, of the Premier League. We've, we've all got Man City. Still. Has everyone got Man City? Yeah, yeah. yeah we've all just put Man, Man City. City. Man City. No, I think Everton will win the league because Everton, <laughs> they have done at Calvert Lewin. I'm sorry. Right. <laughs> yeah, right. Like, but they got 65 mil from at Charleston. Sorry, I think if Man City will win, I think Everton will lose. <laughs> Look at this pretty phone. <laughs> <laughs> Add my Xbox time, please. <laughs> oh, oh, please, that's a long video. Um, but yeah, don't forget to subscribe, hit notification bell. Evie! Bye!